What's up, guys? We're going to be opening a Legend of Blue Eyes Korean box. This is the first set from Yu-Gi-Oh! My favorite set. And obviously, I can't afford an American English version. They're up to about 7,000. I've seen some even up to 10. But, so, we're gonna open up this Korean box. So, let's get started. There's 40 packs. These packs are pretty hard to open, so I already pre-cut all 40 of them. And you're not guaranteed a rare in every pack, but there is 40. And the ratios do come out about the same as they do in the English version. So, anyways, let's get started. Guaranteed a rare in every pack. That's okay. This box is only like 20 bucks on eBay, so it's not a big deal. Oh, Dragon Capture Jar in Korean. Fisher, nice. seen most of the hollows are in the back so ooh trap hole just speaking of hollows nice all right let's see things i would like to pull would be like a regeki a polymerization a blue eyes white dragon exodia now comes there haven't pulled any of those but yeah Typhoon, I believe. Red School Bird, I think. Oh, it's hollow. It looks like Regeki. Nice. I was just speaking of that. Nice. Oh, Flame Ghost, I think. Zodia piece either. I really would like a Trihorn Dragon. That's what I really want. I have most of the set in English already, but I don't have a Trihorn Dragon and I can't afford an English version, so that's why I bought this Korean box. Hoping to pull that. I wouldn't mind a Blue Eyes either, even though I, even, I got it in English. But another one wouldn't be bad. Wouldn't be complaining. It's all commons in that one. Ooh, two prong attack, I believe. Very really cool. Still, just two hollows. Though. Oop, this one looks like a hollow. Ooh, a polymerization. Nice. Got English already, but. 
free and it's cool too. All commons. And this is a really cool box for twenty dollars. If you would like to live and go back to nostalgia, ooh, mystical elf. I would recommend buying one of these. It's only like twenty bucks on eBay, and it's just kind of cool to relive the past. Ooh, think stop. Stop defense, I believe. It's cool. Another rare. Oh! Alright, it looks like an Exodia piece. And yeah. Cool. Yeah. Already got a set in English from LOB, but Korea piece is cool too. Ooh! I forget the name, but cool. Another rare. Where are you at? Let's see. No commons. Another rare. Man. we got? We got five. Should be. Oh, dark magician. Nice. Yeah, that's not bad at all. Feel like a triumph or... This card's funny. It's they changed the name to Trial of Nightmare on the Unlimited Edition. In the first edition, it was Trial of Hell. So that's that's pretty cool. All commons. Let's see. So far, not a bad box. So even regardless, if we don't pull triumph, horn. all commons. Fisher again, can't complain. Frenzy Panda, I believe. Another two prong attack. Two, just two packs left. Let's see if we can pull a try. Nope, another rare. One more pack. Just a rare, man. Well, I didn't get what I wanted, but let's go through what we got. Still some pretty good pulls. A Dark Magician, an Exodia piece, Mystical Elf, a Polymerization, uh, sorry about that guy, a Regeki, and a Trap Hole. Well, it's not too bad. Let's go ahead and go through our rares. Two prong attack, a fisher. Forget the name of him. Let's see. Giant soldier of stone. I think that's what that is. Stop defense. Two prong attack. Flame ghost. Fisher. A dragon capture jar. And a fusionist as a rare. Well, not not a bad box, guys. Well, I suggest if uh, you would like to open a L.O.B. booster box and can't afford the English and would like to live 
the past, I'd recommend buying one of these. Well, anyways, y'all have a nice day and thanks for watching.